Alright guys, so today's video is going to be completely different because in this video, we're going to be playing Pokemon Go. And yes, this is the first time I'm making a video on the game Pokemon Go. So you guys know Pokemon Go has been a game that I've been playing before I started playing Roblox. So yes, it is true that I played Pokemon Go before I started playing Roblox. So before we start, please make sure to leave a like and subscribe with notifications turn on and let's jump right into it. So we're inside of a Tapu Koko raid, and there's like 12 people in here, so we're definitely going to beat this guy, so we just have 30 seconds left until we can beat the Tapu Koko raid. And we're definitely going to take this down. There's like 14 people in here, so we're definitely going to do this. Come on, Groudon. Oh, uh, wait, hang on. My shiny Groudon is in here, so all right, let's go in this one. I believe this is my level 40 Groudon, so let's go ahead and come on. Come on. Press it, Blaze. You can do this. Boom! Come on! We can do this! We can do this! We can do this! Press the blaze! Come on! Come on! Yo! It's already half HP! And there's... We are... We only have like... We um... We have not... Um... Reached the... Halfway mark yet. And he's already almost dead. And ooh! Someone's using a shiny Garchomp right there! Oh my god! That, that's crazy! So... Um... Come on! Come on! It's red! It's red! Come on! Come on! And press the blades! Come on! Come on! Yup! 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 There we go! There we go! So, the hundo, I believe, is 1810. So, wait, what is it gonna be? What is it gonna be? It's gonna be a 2210! Wait, this is a weather boosted one! Oh, I didn't realize that! Okay, let's see. Let's see if we can get a shiny on this one. So, here we go. In 3, 2, 1... Nope, it's not a shiny. And let's go ahead and catch this guy. So, okay, he's moving to the- What? What just happened? Oh my god. Let me throw this. Okay. Let's see. One, two, and it breaks out. Let me try that again. Okay, let's see if I can make an excellent- Oh my god, I'm having trouble doing- uh, Okay. Okay. Oh, that was a bad throw. Oh my god. <laughs> One, two, and it breaks out. Let's try that again. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Um, if we if we have time, we might be able to do a Mega Sceptile raid. Because, um, I be so currently Mega Sceptile is the number one grass type in Pokemon Go. And the fun fact, it can also launch its tail when it, um, like, during a battle. And we caught the Tapu Koko. So let's go ahead and appraise it. Hopefully it's really good, but I don't remember what the hundo is weather boosted. So let's go ahead and... Check the IVs. Not bad. I'll take it. Three star. All right. So okay. So this is this one has the brand new move, Nature's Madness, and I'm gonna give this one uh, electric. So Volt Switch does work. So anyways, we won the raid. So there is another five star raid, but we're gonna see if we can go find a Mega Sceptile raid right now. All right. So it looks like there are no raids around me right now, but I'm gonna go ahead and activate a uh, Daily Adventure Incense. Ooh, there's a wild Meowth right over here. Not shiny, but we should be able to look for more spawns on the way. So let's go ahead and start walking. So let's see what we can get. All right, so we just found a wild Grubbin right over here. So I'm going to go ahead and... Oh my god, did I just waste my one and only Ultra Ball? No, no, I'm missing. Okay, we made a throw. So let's see. One, two, three. Okay, we caught the wild Grubbin. So let's go ahead and tap OK. So let's see what IVs bad. Okay, let me transfer it. Ooh, another Caterpie. Nope, not shiny. But I'm gonna go ahead and oh, actually I'm not gonna catch it because um I don't want to fill up my storage so quickly. So um, I'm just gonna continue walking to see what we can get. Hey, we found another grub in here. So um let's go ahead and catch this guy. And great throw. All right, let's see what we get. One, <coughs> two. Three. Oh wait, maybe we haven't, um, I have not encountered a Galarian bird today, but let's see, nope, bad, transfer, and I'm gonna go ahead and d take down that gem right there so I can get some Pokey coins in, and, um, I also got my, um, I also got my Stardust in, so I used a star piece and claimed my PvP re rewards, because, uh, you know, ooh, Wild Skitty, oh my god, 
So, um, in the meantime, while I'm walking, let's talk about how I've been playing this game. So, first of all, I've been playing this game since November of 2016, and I have not been, um, playing. Um, nowadays, <coughs> I've been grinding a lot. <coughs> you know, I prim primarily make Roblox videos on my YouTube channel, but today's video, it's a completely new game on my YouTube channel. So this is my first ever Pokemon Go video as you read the title correctly. And we're almost at the gym. There's a Dedenne. There's a Buizel. Okay, not shiny. But let's see what we can get. There um, are Pokestops here. So let me go ahead and Mankey is not shiny. Um, hang on. Okay, let me go spin that Pokestop right there. Oh, dang, my bag is full. Dang it. Okay. Okay, you know what? We're not going to spin Pokestops because lately... I've not been spinning Pokestops because my back keeps, it keeps saying my back is full, so let's go ahead and, ooh, Cricket, Cricket Tot, who's a Lily Pup, um, okay, let's see, Dedenne, and we got, ooh, ooh, there's a Pinsir, there's a wild Pinsir here, Oh, that would have been shiny there, <laughs> okay, there's Glamo here, not shiny, but uh, we're okay, we're at the gym, so let's go ahead and take this guy down. So we're gonna use mainly fighting types. So let me go ahead and put my Machamp in here. So let's go ahead and start with our Blaziken. So let's go, and here we got Blaziken. Taurus, I think it's better to use my Machamp because it has the fighting type charge move. So let me go in one, two, three, four, <coughs> five. Okay, dynamic punch. Boom. I think we have to beat this guy a couple of times. So. <laughs> Uh, let's try that again. Alright, okay. Oh, <laughs> no, it's, I'm not using a Galarian Bird. I don't really use Galarian Bird in battles, because they're not really good IVs. So, let's go ahead and do this one right here. Super effective. Okay, boom, boom. Alright, we took it down. Okay, let's do it one more time. And let's go here. Alright, let's do this one more time. Okay, I'm battling against a Taurus. It's 300 CP. Um, the initial CP was like 800, so... Okay, one, two, three. I believe it's down. Zero CP. Alright, let's go ahead and put one of our best Pokemon. Unfortunately, you cannot put Legendaries or Ultra Beasts in the gym or Mythicals. Alright, let's go here. I'm gonna put... I'm gonna just put a Dragonite in here. So I'm gonna give it... Full, I'm gonna give it berry so it can be it can stay there overnight. Ooh, the wild axe two. Oh my god. I've never I've I've caught axe twos in the wild and there's a Lediba. Okay, not shiny. Oh, if we could get a shiny in this video, that would be cool. But let's go ahead and ooh, looks like there's Team Go Rocket, so we're gonna go ahead and battle him. So let's just keep walking and we should be there soon enough. And ooh, there's a dealing. Wait. Not shiny. I thought that was a shiny right there. But, okay, not shiny. Um, Alright, let's go battle this grunt right here. These waters are treacherous. Oh, okay, this is the... Oh, God. Okay, um... Oh, my God. I don't really know what to use my potions on, but... I'm gonna go ahead and reheal these guys. I'm gonna put Kartana in first, because Kartana is the number one at non-mega grass type. So, let's go ahead and do that. Okay, go Kartana. We might need to switch, um... We might need to um, switch to Hisui and Decidueye because Shadow Empoli, he might, he, the Grunt might use a Shadow Empoleon and unfortunately, uh, water is, uh, grass type isn't really good on steel. Ooh, he's got a Crawl Drunt. Oh my god, he's got Snarl. Okay, I'm going to use up my Leaf Blade. These are the right, the perfect attacks for Kartana. So we got excellent throw. All right, that one's down. Oh, and I think he's using a Whis, Whiskotch. Okay. Down it goes. Down it goes. Alright, we beat it, the grunt, guys. Manners never give me anywhere, and we won. If we get a shadow uh, Pokemon that's 13, 13, 13, minimum of 13, 13 IVs, we can get a hundo. So, let's go ahead and catch this bad boy. One, two, three. Okay, we caught it. So, let's go ahead and... Okay. Alright, let's see what his IVs pretty bad <laughs> okay let me transfer it so all right oh top no that one no i can't i failed to catch one wait this is a sand shrew i really want a shiny badoof but i've never gotten i never have a sh i don't even have a shiny badoof in my collection oh the surf kit not shiny 
but ooh, Quaxley, no, a uh, shiny, a uh, Quaxley cannot be shiny. Yeah, just yet. But maybe during their com the Gen 9 community days, they will debut their shiny releases. Ooh, Fui Coco. Oh, this is not not that's not good enough. Wait, Snobu? No. But um, there's a Pokestop, but we're not gonna be able to spin any Pokestops in this video, cause ooh, so Woolbat. Um, I caught a Hundo Woolbat once, like this year. I've caught a Hundo Woolbat, and I also caught a Hundo Voltorb at the Sinnoh tour. But um, that was like before I started making videos, which this is gonna be my first ever Pokemon Go video. So let's go ahead and see what else we can get. Okay, so the, the, the Dene Raid, there's no Mega Sceptile, unfortunately, so, but I want to show you what Mega Sceptile really looks like. So this is him right here. You can see his tail is pointing in the front. The reason why it's doing that is because it launches its tail, which is kind of awesome. It's kind of insane that he actually launches its tail. We also got Mega Blaziken, and we also got Mega Swampert, so, which, um, I have all three of the Hoenn Mega Starters. I'm just missing Mega Venusaur. And uh, I haven't gotten uh, Mega Lupani. I'm almost done uh, with the Mega decks. Like, I just need like 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40. So that's about seven more Megas registered th to the Pokey decks. But, anyways, I am almost home. So, alright, so I just found a wild Electabuzz right here. So I'm gonna go ahead and catch this guy. I only have one Silver Panap Berries. And if it breaks out, we're essentially screwed. And luckily, it did not break out. So, I'm actually pretty lo darn lucky here. So, let's go ahead and check the IVs. Whoa! Not bad! I'll take it! It's a three-star. Not bad. And, uh, I have, um, I'm working on evolving my event, Electivi uh, Electabuzz, that I caught ba back last year. So, okay, let's see if, let's just shiny check everything. So the recap of today's video is that we got this Tapu Coco right here, which I wasn't expecting that many people to be in the raid. There was like 14 people in the raid, and this one's got the exclusive exclusive move Nature Madness, and I also got a three-star IV Electabuzz, which um, I'm sure I don't know if I want to transfer it, but I'm probably gonna keep it. And this is my most proud moment of this video to in today's video so if you enjoyed my first ever pokemon go video make sure to leave a like and subscribe when notifications turn on and i'll see you guys in my next video peace